Samantha Jane Morton is an English actress, screenwriter and director. She has received critical acclaim and numerous accolades throughout her career, including one BAFTA TV Award, one Golden Globe Award and has been nominated twice for an Academy Award and once for an Emmy Award. Morton began her acting career with guest roles in television shows such as Soldier Soldier and Cracker before appearing from 1995 to 1996 in the ITV drama Band of Gold. She then starred in the period dramas and coming-of-age features Emma, Jane Eyre and the history of Tom Jones, a foundling. The well-received Under the Skin made director Woody Allen cast Morton in Sweet and Lowdown, which earned her an Academy Award nomination for Best Supporting Actress. She then went on to play critically praised roles in smaller and independent projects such as Morvan Caller and In America. For the latter, she received a second Academy Award nomination, this time for Best Actress, for her performance as the young Irish mother, Sarah, coping with life in New York City. At this time, she also found commercial success with 2002's science fiction thriller Minority Report, opposite Tom Cruise. For her role as Myra Hindley in 2006's Longford, she won a Golden Globe Award for Best Supporting Actress. In 2007, Morton appeared in the biographical films Control and Elizabeth, The Golden Age. The same year, she also played a Marilyn Monroe impersonator in Mr. Lonely. She went on to star in Synecdoche, New York and The Messenger. She made her directorial D.U.Q.B.U.T. with the 2009 British television film The Unloved, for which she won a BAFTA Television Award for Best Single Drama. After a three-year withdrawal from film, she appeared in John Carter, Cosmopolish, Decoding Annie Parker and the 2014 period film Miss Julie. Directed by Liv Ullman. Early Life Morton was born in Nottingham, the third child of Peter Morton and Pamela Freebury, a factory worker. She has six half-siblings from her parents' relationships, subsequent to their 1979 divorce. She lived with her father until she was eight when she was made a ward of court, because neither of her parents could care for her and her siblings. Her father was an abusive alcoholic and her mother was involved in a violent relationship with her second husband, and as a result, she never lived with her parents again. The next nine years were spent in and out of foster care and children's homes. During that time, she attended West Bridgeford Comprehensive School and joined the Central Junior Television Workshop when she was 13, soon being offered small screen roles in Soldier Soldier and Boone. In September 2014, Morton, triggered by the Rotherham child sexual exploitation scandal, discussed in a video interview the sexual abuse she experienced while in foster care system as a child in Nottingham and that the police took no action when she reported the abuse. She stated in the interview that she had felt curious about not being allowed to live with her parents. I knew from when I was very little what care order I was on, who owned me, why they owned me, and what rights I had because every little girl wants to live with her mummy, and I wasn't allowed, so I needed to understand why, and later on expressed devastation over the fact that she was never allowed to go back to the home, so I didn't get to say goodbye to the people I loved. Morton had discussed the abuse previously while promoting the semi-autobiographical drama. The unloved in an article for The Guardian, under the effects of drugs, she threatened an older girl who had been bullying her. She was convicted of making threats to kill. She served 18 weeks in an attendance center.